Good morning, my dear students. Today we are going to start with Unit 2, The Box House, Part 2, Our Grammar. Lesson 2. Let's start. Run on sentences. Lesson 2 is talking about run on sentences. What's the meaning of sentence at the first? A sentence is a group of words that has a subject and a verb. A sentence is a group of words that has a subject and a verb. The dog plays catch. The dog plays catch. I can see here the subject dog and I can see the verb plays. So, this is a sentence. But what about a run-on sentence? What the meaning of a run-on sentence? Is a group of words that has two sentences inside. I don't have one sentence. I have two sentences inside. Run-on sentences have to split up. What the meaning of split up? I have to divide it. I have to write the first sentence and the second sentence. What is this meaning or how can I do it? Let's see the first example. Charlie knocked on the door. Billy opened it. I can see here two subjects and two verbs. Can you tell me, is it right? No. How can I write it or how can I fix it? I'm going to start with the capital letter, Charlie, knocked on the door. Then I'm going to put follow stop. Then start with the second sentence in a capital letter, Billy, opened it and then put follow stop at the end. So, when I have two sentences with two subjects and two verbs, I'm going to divide them. How? I'm going to write the first sentence in a capital letter and at the end put follow stop. Then start the second sentence with a capital letter like Billy and end my sentence in a follow stop. Another example. Rover ate the food. He likes chicken. I have here two subjects and I have here two verbs. How can I write my sentence? Is it right? No. How can I fix it? Let's see. I'm going to start with the, the first sentence, Rover, in a capital letter, eat my, my verb, the food, and then put follow stop. Then the second sentence, he, capital letter, likes my verb, chicken, and put at the end, full stop. The second example, it's your turn. I need your help. This homework is hard. I have two sentences. How can you write them? Is it right? No. What should I do? I can hear you, excellent. I'm going to start with the first one in a capital letter I. Need your help, then put my full stop, then start the second sentence, this homework, in a capital letter like can you see? Yes, yeah, super! T in a capital letter, this homework is hard, then put at the end full stop. Super! So, run-on sentences have to be split up and we say split up which means to divide our two sentences. And the run-on sentence is a group of words that has two sentences inside. It's not one sentence. A run-on sentence has two sentences inside. Thank you, my dear students. See you next time. Bye!